flanked by the recent ministers of justice, policing and mental health and addictions, Saskatchewan party leader Scott Moe outlined his party's plan for addressing crime and dealing with those struggling. Moe says if elected, his government would amend legislation that would grant police authority to shut down nuisance properties and give more authority to police officers to deal with vandalism and intoxication on public property or in places like shopping malls. He also recommitted to the Marshal Service, which will bring in 70 officers once operational. We'll also react to criticism from the National Police Federation, which represents RCMP officers. It says the Marshal Service is not needed. The Marshal Service is going to work with the RCMP and Rhonda Blackmore. So let's be clear about that. The public sector union, the NPF, is going to advocate on behalf of what they feel will you know, essentially um, make, make for more officers and more union dues, and let's be that callous about it. Mo also criticized the NDP's platform on public safety and claimed the NDP wanted to legalize drugs. NDP leader Carla Beck says that is a lie. Mr. Moe pretends he wants to run on his record. I've seen him do everything but. I've seen him run from his record. I've seen him point fingers at other places. I've seen him come up with desperate lie after desperate lie about us and our plan. We've been very clear about our plan. I'm very capable of speaking for myself and what our plan is. Beck says her plan is to cut the marshal service and reinvest the $20 million into hiring frontline police officers and mental health and addictions supports. Adam Hunter, CBC News, Regina.